Now, it's not often on London tonight that we can celebrate the heavyweight championship of the world, but that's precisely what we're doing this evening. It was David versus Goliath on Saturday night, and yes, David won. Bertmansley's own boxing hero, David Hay, beat the seven-foot-tall Nikolai Valuev to win the WBA title in Germany. Marcus Powell was caught up with our new champion. The boy from Bermondsey, the new heavyweight champion of the world, David Hay, returns to London but with a broken hand as a reward for his giant taming exploits in Germany. So he had to perform some more unorthodox moves to greet well-wishers in his hometown, where everyone wanted rounds. You know, when you're punching the giant in the head, you know, you, you occasionally break your hands. So um, I, hit a, I bounced one off his jaw in the second round and uh, coincidentally broke my hand. You know, he was a very, very tough, strong lad. You know, I've never... I've never been in a ring or, you know, even been up close to someone who has a sort of his seven foot two and, you know, 20, 23 and a half, 24 stone. He may be seven stone lighter and about a foot shorter than the giant Russian Valuev, but many years ago he'd made his mum a promise and he wasn't going to let her down. So in the final... It's been a long journey from the family home in Bermondsey to the top of the world via the local Fitzroy Lodge Boxing Club under the railway arches just a few yards from the luxury Riverbank Hotel, where he now holds court. But the local boy is true to his roots, even if a new world champion hasn't yet found time to pop in to see the family. No, he couldn't, he couldn't get out there, no, but he all watched it, all the family uh, gathered round and watched it, um, watched it at home, and it was a, just sort of a, a carnival celebration after the fight, you know. Everybody, everybody believed in me, you know, my parents know, know what, what type of athlete I am. They know when I've, when I've got my mind set on something, I will achieve it.